In this video, I'll show you how to rotate a single page in Word. If you find this guide useful, then please consider subscribing. And once you've done that, please consider leaving a like and let's get right into this guide. I just want to go and rotate page two. So if I go to the top left and tap on layout and then go and tap on orientation and go and tap on landscape, as you can see, it goes and rotates them all, which isn't what I want to go and do. So let's go and put this back to portrait for now and go and do this. So firstly, you need to come to the first page. What you need to do is just put your cursor after the last bit of content. So in this case, for me, it's after one. Then go back to home in the top left like so. And what we need to do is go and show our paragraph marks. So go and tap here like so. And as you can see, it shows all these different sort of tools here. We can remove it in a minute. We just need it just for now. Then what you need to do is come back to layout like so. And what we need to do is go and add some section breaks. So go and tap on breaks like so. And then where it says section breaks, go and tap on next page like this. It is going to go and push the other pages into another one, but all you need to do is go and click just behind it and then we can just go and use the uh, back key and just go and put it back to where they were. Then what we need to do is go and go to the second page and go and add another section break. So I'm going to go after the last piece of content again and then go back into layout and go and tap on breaks and go and tap on next page. And then once again, it's going to go and push page three into the fourth page. But don't worry because we can go and use our cursor, click on it, and then we can go and use the back key and go and get it back to where it originally was just like this. And then what you want to do is once again, go and put your cursor after the last bit of content on the third page or whatever page you're on. Then we can go and create another breaks, tap on breaks and go and press next page like so. So in this case, I only have three pages, but you need to keep repeating what I was doing until you've added a section break to all of the pages. Then once you've done that, you need to go and choose which page uh, you want to go and rotate. So in this case, I want to do page two. So then what I'm going to go and do is go and tap on layout and then press an orientation and press landscape. And as you can see, we've now just gone and rotated this page here because we've gone and created section breaks. So each page is a different section and you can go and change the orientation orientation of it individually. And now that we've done that, we can now go and hide these paragraph marks. So come back to home and go and tap on the paragraph button and that's it. 